Another big story we are following tonight. Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine now has full FDA approval. Previously, the FDA had only granted emergency use authorization of that vaccine. That means the vaccine is no longer considered as being an, an experimental phase. And local infectious disease experts say the approval will likely lead to a slew of vaccine mandates. Crown Force Dan Kerman has been talking to medical experts about all this, and he joins us live from UCSF with more. Dan. Well, we've seen lots of places throughout the Bay Area and California already put in these mandates, governments as well as universities. It's not the case necessarily all the way across the country. Many corporations and businesses and universities waiting for this, infectious disease experts say. Now they say they will go ahead and put forth that mandate like we're seeing here. The FDA's full approval of the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine could lead to a dramatic increase in the number of people vaccinated. Businesses and institutions in the United States, uh, a lot of them have been waiting for this FDA approval before mandating vaccination. So I think we're going to see a lot more uh, institutions like universities, um, governmental institutions, um, and private enterprise now mandating vaccination. UC Berkeley infectious disease specialist Dr. John Schwartzberg says it may also convince individuals on the fence to push ahead on their own. A lot of people who said, I really genuinely want to see what the FDA has to say and where they give it its real stamp of approval. And I think they're going to get vaccinated and that will help. And medical experts say the FDA's full approval of Pfizer's vaccine could also have a global reach. The fact that it stands up to that scrutiny uh, is good news. And because the rest of the world looks at that process uh, for legitimacy, the people who may be on the fence in the rest of the world who are more hesitant about it may also then see it as a way forward. UCSF infectious disease specialist Dr. Peter Chin Hong says that will help get more people vaccinated worldwide which is really what's needed to put an end to this pandemic. It's not too late. In fact, this is the time. Uh, it may be too late in the future when we have another variant. But right now, we have the technology, we have the tools, and hopefully this will give us the push to get more people vaccinated so that we don't have to get to that point where we'll have to do this all over again. Now, Moderna has also applied for full FDA approval. Experts expect that to come sometime within about a month. Live at UCSF, Dan Kerman, Cron 4 News.